<laughs> no, farting is pretty cool. Yeah, you know. If it wa- if there wasn't whoopee cushions, wouldn't be the hottest Christmas I mean, gift ever year. It's the best thing in the world. <laughs> America's favorite stocking stuffer. An underrated classic, according to the man at Party City. <laughs> Did that really be said? Yeah. An underrated classic. Yeah. Well, he was like, it's a classic, but we don't sell a whole lot of these anymore. This guy loved his job. <laughs> He really did. Dude. <laughs> he loved his job and hated his childhood. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, he's got like the Michael Jackson vibe where he's like, I missed out on my childhood. No, I'm gonna so get... I'm going to relive it as an adult by just doing like youthful things. <laughs> like, I'm going to be a manager at Party City. <laughs> I don't have any money, so I'm going to manage a Party City. <laughs> Michael Jackson was unsuccessful. He would have just been like, I work for the Fox Department. <laughs> I run summer activities in the park. <laughs> we play games. <laughs> uh, no, I went in there. I went in there to pick up the whoopee cushions. And I was like, hey, man, where are the whoopee cushions? And he was like, you must be the one who called. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I've been waiting for you, man. <laughs> Maybe that's why he had all that banter ready. He's he been waiting prepped. for. He's been waiting for me to show up all day. <laughs> well, you told him that, and then he just keeps thinking about. It. He's talking to people. <laughs> Somebody call about Whoopi Cushion. He read the Wikipedia page for Whoopi Cushion. <laughs> he learned about. He learned about Roman Emperor Alagalabus. <laughs> You would, you would, for his dinner parties, he'd put a whoopee cushion under people's chairs. Yeah. In ancient Rome. I don't, do they, are whoopee cushions really that old? Yeah. Apparently, like, in, like, what they make them out of? Uh, 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 inflated animal bladders. Huh. And then, uh, in the 20s, they became known the way we know. Well, they really haven't changed the design at all from the bladder. No. <laughs> There's got to be a more efficient whoopee cushion. Doing <laughs> Steve Jobs presentation Dude, on a new sleep The guy who invented cushion. the whoopee cushion almost didn't. Uh, he was like, no, nah, it's too vulgar. Too vulgar? Yeah, he's like, this shit's g- gross, man. Wasn't he throwing fucking like, people in things with lions and shit? <laughs> <laughs> this is in the 20s. This isn't the emperor. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> then there are the modern will be good. Was this uh, parallel thinking, or was he aware of this uh, emperor? I'm going to assume it's parallel thinking, because the idea is just out there, man. That would be great <laughs> if you're like a history professor and you're like, for instance, Emperor Agalibus <laughs> would inflate animal blood, and then someone's like, you know, that's a really smart idea. <laughs> I've got an idea. My uncle works for a polyurethane rubber company. <laughs> Maybe we could get the design. And I've it. got big lungs. I can fill up whoopee cushions all day. <laughs> whoopee cushions lack durability and can break easily, lasting longest when they are not sat on with excessive force. <laughs> lasting longest when used as display objects. <laughs> Dude. Similar noise can be made by inflating a toy balloon and then releasing it. Or with your ass. <laughs> or with your asshole. They have a video of a whoopee cushion in case you can't. Do they in have case a, they're banned where you live. Do they have a video? <laughs> it's a video, but there's no sound. It's just showing slow motion. It's showing a slow motion whoopee cushion like end from two different angles. <laughs> it just looks like like a, when they're like, we went to the Mariana Trench and filmed fish, and you're like, wow, cool. I the, guess the Earth is crazy. All right, David Attenborough. It's black and white. Black and white. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> that's very dramatic. How do whoopee cushion sound? <laughs> well, it's in slow motion, isn't it? No, that sound doesn't sound like an echoey that. metal sound. <laughs> They're showing someone popping a whoopee cushion. Oh my what god, he's on a big whoopee cushion bed. <laughs> Why do they have him in this metal room? These are some huge whoopies. It's probably a room with a uh, good, uh, you know. Whoa, it took two people to whoop that cushion. <laughs> <laughs> It 
<laughs> Damn, dude. Hey, man, if, if anyone's listening to this, go and see Ron on <laughs> playing it in the tapes. <laughs> well, I Googled uh, countries whoopee cushions are banned in, and you know what? It looks like the whole world's pretty accepting of a nice little fart every now and then. We should we should look up. We should ban whoopee cushions. <laughs> we should make our in money America. banning banning whoopee cushions. And then buy a bunch. No, we should find a country where we can't. Like we should look up every like Ethiopia where to buy whoopee cushions. <laughs> Do every country and in anyone where we can't find a good thing. Let me grab my globe and let's start going. <laughs> we, yeah, get a globe. Get your globe and a marker. <laughs> No, but we'll start, we'll sell, we'll bring whoopee cushions to whatever countries don't have them. Yeah, that'll be our humanitarian effort. Hey. No, our money-making effort. No, we should do this pro bono. We'll bring whoopee cushions to, uh, Vice will make some, like, thing about us where it's like, these American idiots are bringing <laughs> whoopee cushions <laughs> to the car. <laughs> We're here in Central Africa Republic. Daniel Alton and Eric Sorgel. Surprise, surprise. They inspired Whoopi Goldberg's stage name. Really? Dude. <laughs> Why don't you lead with that? After repeatedly passing gas backstage during a theatrical production in San Diego, actress Whoopi Goldberg's real name, friends, compared her to a Whoopi cushion. What's her real name? Later... They described her as gross. <laughs> Later, she kept doing it. <laughs> and it became not cool. That's uh, Karen Elaine Johnson. That's a dumb name. <laughs> oh, there, you'll never guess the celebrity fans of uh, Whoopi Cushions. Howard Stern. Bob Saget and Bob. Leslie Nielsen. Bob's oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Rikishi from the wrestling. <laughs> well, I feel like this is a low number for someone who claims to be such a big fan. It's frightening how much I know about them, Saget, who says he's worn out 10 since his childhood. That's not that I mean, is nothing. I feel like we ran out 10, like, on a whim. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> well, because they're so easy to wear out. Plus, it's going to freak out your dog and then they'll bite it. Yeah. Oh. You ever have one of the self-inflating whoopee cushions where it's like a piece of foam in it? Yeah. I had one of those. That was cool. Those are great. Now that's what I was hoping to find. Now you're cooking with fake gas. That, that's what I was... <laughs> I was really hoping to find one of those, but they don't sell whoopee cushions like they used to Dude, anymore. Nah. I remember them being in the toy aisle. Yeah, man. With all the, the shitty toys that you don't really want, but then you're like, oh, hell like yeah. Like those cap... The guns with the things? Yeah, or like a ball in a cup. <laughs> <laughs> Like a, Fucking hoop, hoop. like a hoop and yeah. sticker. <laughs> Canned kick. A blank, a, bo- a block of wood and a spike and a photo of a horse like a carved wo- out of wood. A wooden boat. <laughs> you can carve your own horse. Uh, who doesn't like a fucking... Oh, butt trumpets. <laughs> butt trumpets. <laughs> Alternative name. <laughs> There's an alternative band. We got meat puppets, butt, butt trumpets, trumpets, and, and fishbone. And fuck monkeys. This week at the Civic Center. <laughs> Jimmy and the Big Swill. Hey, if you like that video, there's more where that came from. Don't forget to subscribe and scroll down and hit that little bell while you're at it, too, to get notified every new video.